Welcome back YouTubers! Today we're going to take a look at some brand new Majorette Caravan sets. These feature the cars and the special trailers to come with it. From the early 80s to the early 2000s, Majorette had always released Tovok with cars in their mainline uh, series. It can be uh, comeback cars like this one, the Datsun 2620, a station wagon like a Volvo, a basic sedan like a BMW, or even later on a pickup truck and some SUVs. All of these cars were compatible with a lot of nice and unique trailers, all the way from kayaks to some uh, vacation caravans and some other cool looking travel cab like these and some fastened one like this one with stickers and opening door following their tradition Majorette released a new series featuring a caravan and a vehicle in for 2018 this set came with five vehicles available for a purchase First one is this guy, the Volkswagen van with a boat. Two different Volkswagen transporter. You have this one in yellow and white, two-tone paint job. And you have this one, which is, could be a chase model, but major usually don't make chase, but they, they make like a more limited run model. And this one was only one per case, so I was able to find one. And you also have this Volkswagen Bill, which is a new towing with an opening trunk and a two-tone paint job caravan in blue and white. The set also have this guy right here, which is already opened up, which is the Ford F-150 Raptor in yellow. This guy does have an opening hood with a big V engine. And this caravan, which is the same as the Chase model Volkswagen. Let's start with the fork since it's already opened up. So the guy, this guy features a yellow paint job. You have the Raptor logo on the top right here. You have real light tempos. Ford printed on the back of the bed. F-150 and Raptor on the both sides. Some uh, looks like a little bit of dirt, black dirt over here in the side skirts and a raptor logo on the hood with more dirt by the way this is the same casting as the regular ford f-150 they just changed i uh, think the tempos variation on the front and the back to make it looks like a raptor but it's not a new casting and you can tell directly by looking at the base which is a just a basic ford f-150 you have the suspension like all major models, which is very cool. The tow hook in the back for the trailer. Some very nice side view mirrors. Very proportioned to the truck. Painted the black pillars here. Of course, the big Ford logo on the front with the headlights. And of course, the five liter V8 engine on the back here of this hood, which is very nice. The trailer. Well, I was very surprised when I actually opened this up because, uh, like Magic, Matchbox Holidays, they all made stuff in plastic to reduce the cost of their production line. But for the case of Majorette, it's not the case. This thing is ridiculously heavy compared with the uh, Hot Wheel Black Wall Greyhound bus. This is as heavy as it is. This is absolutely ridiculous. All of the silver parts is metal. So you can feel the bit weight of this trailer. The, the base is also metal, which is very surprising, except this little part right here, like the plastic, uh, black plastic here. And let's see what we have. What is the name of this guy? Hairstring Sport 16 trailer. This is a 172 scale trailer made in Thailand. So we have a little hazard here for um, orignoles. 
a black star kind of military style here some markers for the lights back tail lights Airstream logo here on the top and you have an opening door with a detailed interior unfortunately I don't have a lot of lights that can come through there but it's a very very nice touch I love this trailer so we can attach easily on the back of this F-150 it's too heavy god damn it no, I'm just kidding and it rolls very well And you can turn with ease with the trailer and the vehicle attached. Just like the good old ones from the past. So this is this was the only Ford model in the set. All the other ones are brought to you by Volkswagen. So we're gonna take a look at this little bus right here with a boat in a second. Alright, next guy. We have this Volkswagen bus with the uh, sailing boat looks like you can also get this vehicle in the single with the um, I think like a camping trailer set you can get a, like a citron cactus with the kayak on the top you can get a um, RV all white and you can get also um, like an off-road uh, vehicle ATV of some kind so this guy is the Volkswagen T6 bus this is a 161 scale model. You have some uh, a white and green two-tone paint job. Surf on the back here as a graphy light looks. You have a hippie logo on the side here. And it looks like uh, what's right here right here. East Classic 2016. 48 robe. I think this is what's right. So it's cool. You have the Volkswagen logo in the back with the multi-fan emblem, of course, tail light tempos, another Volkswagen logo here, and some transparent plastic headlights that are part of the window, which is also very nice to look at. And of course, black painted pillar here. Plastic kayak here on the top with a rack to maintain it, and the tow hook. This guy have this seven spoke wheels or ten spokes, try to say. And this is a trailer, a little boat. It says California West Coast Dream on the side here. Another hazard uh, sign here, or like a um, a whale sometime. Yeah, the little engine here, but it does not turn. Some details over here on the front. And this guy have a metal trailer since the boat is all plastic except the blue part. Blue part is metal, which is nice too. Uh, no scale on the trailer, unfortunately. So let's attach this guy, make it roll a little bit. And uh, as expected, roll very nicely and move very well with the trailer attached, just like the Ford. So great job, Major. It. All right, up next, Volkswagen Beetle. Before I continue, if you're interested on the price tag of these, I actually pay about um, $9 each for every single set of these cars. And I found them at a local uh, toy shop that are specialized in major cars. So if you're interested to get these, they are not cheap, but uh, trust me, the quality of these pieces is very, very nice. So it's worth it. Just like your green lights or your M2s or your more expensive toy cars that have more details and such, and metal bases and you know all, all the deal. So this guy, Volkswagen Beetle. We all know this model, very popular along collectors. So this one features a different wheel, which is all painted silver with the black square dots on the center. You have a pink trunk, and surprisingly, this part is metal. So, nice touch here. Close nicely. Add details and lights. We are very, very realistic. A silver trim on the middle of the hood. 
a little very skinny Volkswagen emblem right here. My camera can focus very well, but you can imagine that it's right here. Of course, painted head tail lights, the dog hook, and this guy have suspension like all major models. Well, at least the premium ones that cost a little bit more. The trailer. This is the same model as this bus right here. And so the first time I open up, so I was actually surprised that it's also all metal. So very, very, very heavy compared to the uh, older major trailer, which is our all plastic and very light. This one is surprising me, incredibly heavy. This one is 156 scale, and this is called the Ariba Puck trailer. My dog is like uh, morning right there. <laughs> Big deal. This trailer also have an opening trailer. I have to be careful not to chip the paint right here because it uh, it can happen sometimes. Major uh, major paints are very very nice, but they are not quite durable. And I will explain that in the comparison video when I will do with uh, compared to uh, Hot Wheels and Matchbox cars. So I will not risk it to chip the paint just to open the door. So I will be careful here. Also different wheels on the trailer, which is cool. Now let's take it for a spin. Me, 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 oh, sh oh shit, I lost it. Ah! Just crashed my wheel. Rolls nicely, just like the previous two. All right, the last two, the two buses. Buses, man. Respect the classics. It's Hendrix, like Fillmore says in the Cars movie. So let's take a look at these classics. All right, Volkswagen bus. First model. This is the regular model, not the chase model. So this one is a two-tone paint job, yellow and white. Oh god, this tow hook is quite hard to detach geez what's going on all right hold on I don't want to break my toy all right now I get it why it was so hard to detach the tow hook is in the inverse position so the pin is in this position instead of being like this so that's why it was more difficult to open up god damn it but that's okay at least I didn't broke it so this is it this is the bus Nice Volkswagen emblem in yellow on the top of the front of the compartment right here. You have the sign marker, orange, plastic headlights, like the part of the windows. You have the laser uh, silver wheels, big old suspension like all, all major it models. And what's the scale on this guy? Volkswagen T1 bus, uh, 159 scale. Revolve really, very really nicely. And this guy have an opening tailgate in the back. And I'm not gonna risk to open up because I don't really don't want to mess the paint up. Since we all know that major red models, uh, like I said previously, are they have good paint job, but uh, they are really, really, really uh, fragile when you manipulate it. So I'm not gonna risk it to open up and damage the paint. Now let's take a look at the trailer, which is the same as the bill right over here. Opening door, same feature, metal base, same wheels, and same uh, little tampos on the back for the tail lights. Very heavy piece again. So I'm gonna reattach it. Hey, come on, man. Okay. Hold on. Well, bad news, people. When I, I attempt to reattach the trailer, guess what? The toilet just broke. That's all it is sometimes, but Mage Red, uh, you gotta be careful, like I said, with the toys you're using. So I, I simply just put down like this, trying to attach the trailer, and the, the pin just broke off. So... That's unfortunate. So I guess I'm gonna not gonna be able to uh, try 
the rolling uh, system so I'm gonna maybe I have to replace it later on I don't know what I'm gonna do but you know it is what it is but it's just bad sometimes this is it this is the last mall this is the chase mall Volkswagen bus this one features a burger burger chief logo on the top since 1964 classic burger beef pork and chicken on the back here just next to the side strips this one just like the uh, yellow bus has a opening tailgate with the uh, tail lights and the Volkswagen emblem on the front with the side marker lights this is the same trailer as the previous one that we reviewed with the uh, F-150 Raptor so I'm not gonna show you the same one again same features and this model all very nicely and surprisingly when I opened up this model the trailer just came apart like this and I did not broke the, the pin on this one but I'm not gonna risk again to uh, reattach the trailer because I already broke this one so I'm gonna leave it as it is for now when I figure out what the heck happened here but uh, you know sometimes it measure it they make great vehicle and fantastic details and casting but you know sometimes can be a little bit frustrated to uh, attach stuff and broke and sometimes chip the paints and you know it is what it is so uh, thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed the trailer and matrix presentation video and we'll see you again in another diecast review goodbye everyone <laughs>